Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Tia and I'm Ebony and this is Reacting to the Internet. Let's get into it. Alright guys, you know why you're here. You know what we came to do. Let's get straight into it. Demon Slayer Season 3 Episode 2. Boom. No. Boy, you gross. Ooh. Damn. Stop it. He just Hold be slapped the kid. He just be slapped the kid. My oh, man just bitch slapped the kid, bro. Yo, he just bitch slapped the hell out that kid. Hit it. Hit it. Oh my god. That's what kid, the kids being disrespectful. Dis I mean, he could I just say, hey man, I can't give it to you. I'm not giving it to you. That's what happened there. That's how we started an episode off with a slap. And why my man got three arms? Or maybe I have a pause in between. Yeah, I think he got three arms. Oh, really? Yeah, I think he's modeled after the demon number one. Kind of looks like him, don't he? But yeah, that's what I thought he had all those eyes. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. Like in disguise or something. Hmm. All right. What are you doing? Let him go. There's no need to be so noisy. Hmm. Who are you? Mm. You take your hands off of me. Mm. Ooh. You're weaker than I thought. I'm surprised you got into the core. A demon, perhaps? What are you hiding in there? Didn't they meet before? My man veins popping out, he getting upset. He upset. But guys, didn't they meet before? Like I thought he met all of the demon slayers that's in the upper court. Or I guess it's just one court. I thought they met before. Is that not what happened in like season one or two? So I'm thinking they met already. He ain't acting like they're the man. He not. Like, he acting like he don't know who my man is. So, maybe. Well, he just said, you, you, we could do that thought. So, he got to know who he is. Dang. Because if so, my man acting like he don't know who this man is. Like. Stranger you know, danger. Stranger danger, my dude. That's crazy. I could have sworn they met before. Maybe my man just don't remember people. I don't know. Okay, so it's gonna be their two stories. So the, the AKA girl with the pink and green hair and the mist guy. Mm. You know, you can get all that from the opening sequence. You gotta pay attention. They Cause it showed, it showed the three? Hmm? Cause it showed them three at the beginning? Yeah, so normally in the opening sequence, like the credits or whatever, it tells you what the season's gonna be about. Oh, really? So yeah. So I'm pretty sure at some point we're gonna see all these fight scenes. Oh, really? Episode two, type zero. Well, my man is slow, ain't he? You must be dizzy, though. That's dangerous. Get off me! Mm. I, I'm not giving the key to anyone. You about to cry. I'll cry, too. If you've been through torture training, <gasps> even most grown-ups aren't able to endure through it. You would never last. You a machine? And for no. your age, you're exceedingly stupid. what it means to keep a Hashira away from duty. Ooh. Whether you like it or not, a Hashira's time is worth far more than yours. Oh! Oh. I'm an asshole. You should
should know your place in life and act accordingly. You're not a baby anymore. Ooh. Mm. What are you doing? And don't. And you can't fight like a Hashira. Swordsmiths are still vital. And that's a fact. <laughs> they might not fight, but the skills they have are amazing. Without them, we wouldn't have any swords. It's thanks to them that we can fight. On you. I'm gonna use that on you. I mean, you start you preaching. I'm gonna give you no speed. No worries, I'll carry him back. My man, my man, cold blooded. Did he smack him? He did. Pause for a second. So, I have a question. So, why did they mimic this doll after the upper rank number one demon? Because it's basically the same dude. I wonder why they. Maybe because that. they gotta prepare to fight him. Maybe he really the true leader, and that other guy just he'll be able to defeat the other main main guy and he's really the true leader. Nah, Dracula is definitely the leader. Dracula is gonna get defeated by my man with the six eyes. So you telling me that the upper rank one demon is gonna defeat That's my hypothesis. The Dracula dude. That's the the leader. The one who created them all. That's my hypothesis. The one who was snatching people's heads without moving. That's my prediction. That's your prediction? Let's get back into it. So I'm just wondering, like, why is the upper one so important? Like, what did he do in he his was former human. life? Remember the guy said you acted more like your human side? Remember the bad guy, the Dracula was like, you acted more like your human. He said something like that. Oh, and then yeah. they get a flashback to old boy being human. Yeah. So that's gotta be something connection. Like, so and then, the, then his daddy was like, oh, you know, he was like, I'm um, this great warrior, whatever the case may be. So maybe that's why they maybe get him after him because he was a great warrior when he was a human. Dang, I wonder what the upper rank one demon do. Guys who read the the Magna. Magna, Magna. Manga. Manga. Dang, thank you. Guys who read the manga, let us know. Because I don't really want to wait, but also I want to wait. That's what I want to know. She don't wanna I want to wait. But then I also like, I want to Google it because I'm bound to see something else that I don't want to see. So, let me know. 
against the Hashira. Amazing. Isn't it? It's the battle-type mechanical doll built by my ancestors. The Yoriichi Type Zero. an actual swordsman and the only way they could manage to replicate the swordsman's moves was by giving it six arms so in his demon form he got six eyes that's crazy see about that swordsman who exactly was he he was uh, cold sorry but i don't really know much about him he was from the sengoku period so Time it's never broken down? Incredible. The technology's so advanced, we're still not able to catch up to it. Hey. So if it were to break, there'd be no fixing it. That's why my man didn't want to get a kill. The shade. Wait, sun breathing? The first breathing style? So he really is that amazing. Hmm. But that isn't sun breathing, right? Then he should be able to know how to fix this thing. It's going to break and he's going to have to fix it by tapping into his ancestors' old memories. Mm. So maybe that wasn't his father. Maybe that was like his great great grandfather. Yeah. That makes sense. My man, that's what they do when they get mad. They get them veins on the side of their face. Yeah. That's who. I'll find you. I've got a good nose. Even if it's a bit out of shape. I think he ran off this way. Excuse me. Aww. Come on, you can't give up on your doll. I'll do anything I can to help you out. Everybody, all the good guys gotta give brand speeches. I see. Yeah. I'm a loser, okay? Because of me. It's Did all I go gonna end with my generation. Huh? huh? Ouchie! You cannot give up and walk away from it. My man flicking in the chin. My man hanging on the branch with one arm. Man, you know how strong you gotta be to hang up there with this big on. box on your back. If you fail, maybe you're well, I'm gonna do that. You wanna try? You wanna go outside? I can do that. You can do that. Alright. And to save my sister, who's been turned into a demon. This is mission or something? Yeah. The same way we were able. 
able to when we beat an upper rank. So I know in my heart that someday Muzan Kibutsuchi will fall. Hmm. Is there gonna be action in this episode? You wanna got me watching this girl. training should last until nightfall. I promise I'll see this through to the end. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what? You're already done? I'm finished. It made for good training. take the arm because of the technology in it I, did he give him the sword or did he give him he gave him the sword his he broken did. sword i think he kept the sword he just gave my man his broken sword it was like fix it or something So there was this guy in Naruto and he was considered a doll maker. All I could think about is they need to call my man up. They need to call him up to come fix this doll because I guarantee you he could do it. There was They were called puppet masters or something like that. Mm -hmm. And they had these puppets that they would fight with. And this is what that's giving me. Puppet line. So this, I feel like this show or well, this season is giving me like references to Naruto. Is it just me? Did anybody else feel that way? Cause that's kind of how I feel. Like I can make some connections here to Naruto. I don't know if they're connections or if they're just references or just things that remind me of Naruto. But yeah, they need to call my mans up cause he can definitely come and fix this doll and give it some poison. Mm -hmm. His dolls have poison in them. Now you can train with this doll and become stronger than that indifferent little jerk. And you'll have my full support, no matter what. So maybe he's not an ass, so maybe he's just indifferent. Maybe this is the weapon that they was talking about. Maybe. Oh, you got the secret weapon? Mm hmm. There's a secret weapon in the forest and so on so on. Next time we see him, you can say, Is that all you got, you scumbag? <laughs> it's time to get a haircut, seaweed head. Piss mm. you're ugly and your legs are short. Commit seppuku, mm. you shameless jerk! <laughs> My man is mad! Younger than me. I have to train harder. 
So you can't compare yourself, man. You can't sweaty. do that. Comparison is a thief of joy. Is that how the saying go? I don't think so. better than before. Alright, so this episode is just about him training with his doll to get stronger. Okay. Yes, I can do it. I can land a full strength blow. <laughs> What if it breaks? Do it! <laughs> if it does break, then I... then I'll just fix it! There you go, little man.
That's the weapon. That's the weapon. Hey. That's the weapon. Okay. My man got a new sword. How we feeling? It's cool. It's cool. So that episode was obviously just about him finding the weapon and training. But um, I don't remember. Dang. <sighs> Maybe he was always that nonchalant and just indifferent. My man with the blue eyes. Mm. So maybe he was. I mean, <sighs> I oh, bet you he had rude. a hard life. He was rude. He was quite rude. Doesn't justify being a me. He had a hard life. I don't know his backstory, but I'm yeah. not sure that's the backstory. My man here looks luxurious. It does not look like he had more money. He ain't got the scars. He ain't got nothing under there. They say he was a prodigy, so he was probably spoiled all his life. Mm. Think so? No. Mm. I can see that. I can see that. Maybe he's like, he had to grow up in a stern environment, and his parents was like, no, no, no. Maybe he had the decent size of silver too. Maybe. Ring of the perils of the world since he was a prodigy on it. Yeah, I can see that. I can see that. I can see that. But um, I'm gonna go ahead and head up out of here, guys, because it's about to storm mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. until next time.